able to be here sharing this message with everyone out there to be promoting these wands. The main purpose of these crystals is to heal the earth and to create the thought energy that we can use to help heal the earth. As you can see, clear blue skies out there, just like the ones we used to know when we were young. There's no uh, crisscross, tic-tac-toe BS going on up there because we got the tools to be able to get rid of that stuff. So I was doing prayers on my way here out to Ojibwe Park just to clear a couple chemtrails they were trying to spray over in the sky to uh, basically try to change the weather and make unnatural conditions here in our area. So um, it's been proven by the Weather Network, as I've said before, that they're doing this. So if certain people care enough to invest in the tools to be able to stop it, to increase their frequency so this problem doesn't exist anymore, I'm out here teaching people all around the world, Canada, all around North America, how to use these tools to stop this problem because I see a lot of people posting pictures and videos of their skies and it just looks like a crisscross mess. So basically what you can do is use this wand with the most pointed tip and point it at the sky while focusing on the highest level of energy and love that you possibly can to close the gap between source and humanity here by bridging heaven on earth even further with the power of these words, these prayers, these actions, these intentions. Here we go, we got a sprayer right now. So he's entering the field in which I'm uh, doing the, this uh, prayer and this ceremony right now. And as you can see, there is no uh, chemicals being left behind by his, uh, by his jet engines or whatever the heck spraying there. So these are not contrails. Contrails are different. Contrails are condensation left after um, basically the plane flies over during uh, different atmospheric conditions. So it's really hard to tell the difference unless you're really studying the sky all the time, which not a lot of people are doing. So what I suggest strongly is pay attention to the different patterns and the clouds. Sometimes they look like waves. I don't know if you've ever heard of HARP, but they have different type of weather modification technology. So that the only way to fight against this is to use the highest levels of technology that the earth has to give us, which is crystals. So this is a crystal cut with sacred geometry 144,000 times. The way that this works is it will amplify your thoughts and prayers into every facet of this crystal. And this was proven by Marcel Vocal through uh, scientific experiments. You can see there's no chemtrail there, so that's the main science behind this. It's a spiritual science that's mind over matter, and anyone out there can use this. Thanks so much. Love you guys. Hey everybody out there, it's Ryan Dixon. Um, really grateful to be making this video right now, sharing love with everybody out there that's viewing this. I hope everyone's enjoying the beautiful blue skies, natural cloud formations, just like the ones that we used to know back in the 90s. I don't know if people have noticed, there's like crisscross, tic-tac-toe, X's in the sky, blocking out the sun. This is all a result of geoengineering. I don't really have time to explain this in detail in this video, but if you've gotten this far to be able to see this, you probably have done your own research and realized that a lot of the weather that we're experiencing now is fake. So a lot of people are wondering, what kind of problems is this going to cause for the web of life? Simply, we don't know, but we have been given a solution from the earth to be able to solve this. And the proof I have of this is that I was having dreams of clearing chemtrails with these crystals over and over and over again. And I was thinking, could this be real? Like, so I decided to invest in this crystal just out of the thought of my own imagination to see what it could do. Sure enough, living proof that I can make clear skies with the power of weather shamanism, amplifying my thought energies my thought signals 144,000 times with these crystals. If you don't believe that they can do that, you might want to research Marcel Vogel, the inventor of these crystals, and the inventor of a lot of the computer software that we're using today with our cell phones and uh, TVs, everything. So basically he believed by the amount of facets that you have in a crystal, it can hold that many thought signals or that th many thought energies and output it out into the noosphere, which is like the collective consciousness of the earth and everybody out there. So sounds really complicated but it's actually quite simple and it has to do with holding a crystal focusing on the love within your heart and generating that love outwards into everything that you do pretty soon we won't see these chemtrails anymore and a lot of the other problems are going to disappear on the earth too so thank you so much all of you can play your part in manifesting heaven on earth just by being your most authentic true loving self in all moments don't let anything block you thank you guys peace